nature close to my heart we'll further discuss logarithms do you see here some logs lying we have tried to connect them put them in a row that is kind of doing addition and subtraction with these laws hmm that reminds me of our next chapter now let's see how to combine these logarithms and put them just as one log. I hope you find it interesting. I'm Anil Kumar. Here is a request from one of my students who wants to understand how to work with equations involving logarithms with different bases. So we have taken a couple of examples. Two of them you can see here. Question number one solve log to the base 9 of x minus log to the base 3 of x equals to 0 and the second equation is log to the base 2 of x plus 1 minus log to the base 4 of x equals to 1. Now to solve such equations we have to write all these logarithms in one log so that's the whole issue. How do we do that? We do it with change of base formula, right? So let me share with you the change of base formula. Log to the base A of X, we can always change to any base. So if you choose to change the base to B, it could be written as log to the base B of X, if that is what you want. In that case, the denominator will be log to the base B of A. So both the portions, numerators and denominator, is now written as log to the base of b and both these expressions are equivalent expressions. So we're going to use this change of base formula to solve both the equations. So let's begin with a solution of the first one which is log to the base 9 of x minus log to the base 3 of x equals to 0. At this stage I'll prefer to change the base to 3, right? We can always write 9 as 3 squared. That's the whole idea. So we'll change base to 3. And we also know that 9 is 3 squared, correct? So log to the base 9 will now be written as log to the base 3 of x divided by log to the base 3 of 9. Do you get the idea? Minus. This will retain base of 3. Now the denominator of the first term can be written as log to the base 3 of 3 square. Here we have log to the base 3 of x equals to 0. So that denominator now is equal to 2. So we could write this as half of log to the base 3 of x minus log to the base 3 of x equals to 0. Okay. Now, <clears throat> we could multiply everything by 2 to avoid fractions and um, write this as log to the base 3 of x minus 2 times log to the base 3 of x equals to 0. Okay, now this could be written as minus log 1 minus 2, right? So you could write this as minus log to the base 3 of x equals to 0. Well, since 0 is there, we could just multiply by negative also. That means log to the base 3 of x equals to 0. And writing it back into exponential form, we get x equals to 3 to the power of 0, which is equal to 1. So our solution is x equals to 1. Perfect. So that is how you could do it. Now, there is an alternate way also. Let's go for alternate method. So let me take it on this side now. After this step, log to the base 3 of x minus 2 log 3x 
this could be written as log to the base 3 of x minus log to the base 3 of x square, right, equals to 0. Applying the laws of logarithms, we get log to the base 3 of x over x square equals to 0. Perfect. Which is again same as log to the base 3 of x equals to 0. So we get the same equation. You get the idea, right? So x equals to 3 to the power of 0, which is equal to 1. So either way you do, you get the same result. So I hope that process is absolutely clear. And you have understood how to change the base and then combine the terms together and get the solution. Now, you may pause the video, copy question number 2 and solve. Now let us try to solve question number 2 which is given to us as log to the base 2 of x plus 1 minus log to the base 4 of x equals to 1. First step, we'll change base to 2, right? So we could rewrite this as log to the base 2 of x plus 1 minus log to the base. We want 2, right? Not 4. So we'll write 2x and also divide by log to the base 2 of 4 equals to 1. So we have log to the base 2 of x plus 1 minus log to the base 2 of x divided by log to the base 2 of 4 could be written as 2 square. Then we have log to the base 2 of x plus 1 minus denominator 2 square log to the base 2 means 2, right? So it is half of log to the base 2 of x equals to 1. Now at this stage, we could actually combine them. I'll prefer to multiply by 2 and then combine. So we'll just multiply by 2 all the terms. We get log to the base 2 of x plus 1 minus log to the base 2 of x equals to 2. By doing so, you avoid the radical square root x at this stage, right? So that is why I prefer this particular approach. Now we can combine the log terms since they have the same base. Well, before that, one more step, log to the base 2 of x plus 1 whole square minus log to the base 2 of x equals to 2. Correct? So now let's combine and solve the equation on the right side of this page. So we get log to the base 2 of x plus 1 whole square divided by x equals to 2. Writing it in exponential form, we get x plus 1 whole square divided by x equals to 2 square, which is 4. Now cross multiply, so we get x plus 1 whole square equals to 4x. Expand, we get x square plus 2x plus 1 equals to 4x. Bring the terms together okay equals to 0 which is x square minus 2x plus 1 equals to 0. Now this could be factored and written as x minus 1 whole square equals to 0 that means x is equal to 1. Perfect. So that is how you could actually solve. A lot of steps involved. You could always check the result. So if you want to check, you can substitute log to the base 2, 1 plus 1, minus log to the base 4 of 1. Now this is equal to log to the base 2 of 2 plus 0, right? And what is log to the base 2 of 2? It is just 1, which is the right side, correct? So it works. So that is how you actually solve such a question. So I hope the method is absolutely clear. Uh, I'll provide you with a playlist with few more examples for you to practice. So you can always check few more examples. And also, I'll provide you with a link of change of base formula. That should help. Feel free to write your comments and share your views. If you like and subscribe to my videos, that will be great. Thanks for watching and all the best.